Hello everyone. In this tutorial, we'll show how to use Boolean operations in Vectornator. Let's open Vectornator and choose the resolution 1080 pixels, that is Full HD. I will disable the rules. Then, I will add a layer with the white background. create one more layer and I will lock the background layer and in second layer I will add an image just for a better visibility of the objects I will change the background color to black and I will reduce the opacity of the image check out other luma fusion motion graphics tutorials and vector network tutorial from the above information link a uh, Vectornator app already uh, shows that uh, what each boolean operation does. You can just tap and hold the icon to get the information. Now let's start creating the shapes. I will increase the stroke width. I will fill the shape with the gradient color that I have already created. Then we will change the stroke color to white color. Now I will take one more object or shape and I will change the fill color to some other color gradient. We will keep this shape on top of star shape and we will tap on the first boolean operation. The top shape color will be filled to the entire object. So uh, we will undo it and we will check we will put the star shape on top of the polygon shape. Now we will perform the boolean operation the star shape color will be filled on entire shape now we will create one more object and we'll check the second boolean operation that is subtract we'll create a round shape we'll put it on top of the square shape and we'll tap on subtract boolean operation before that we'll reduce the circle size and keep them in the center by aligning them then we'll tap on the second boolean operation subtract so the circle object is subtracted in the square object Now we'll check the third operation that is intersect.
will create more shapes and keep on top of one another and will apply this operation let's see which type of uh, shapes we will get now it's divided let's separate each shape we can see there are many shapes are created Let's check the last operation that is difference. Let's undo it and keep these objects on top of one another and we'll see which type of uh, effect we will get. Uh, see this is how we use uh, boolean operations to subtract, add, unite, difference and uh, create different type of shapes using these operations. Thanks for watching and subscribe to my channel for more tutorials.